Hmm. Uh, something doesn't seem quite right here. Uh, give me a second. That really sounded weird. Uh, let me let me just reset that. There we go. Audio is still a little bit funky. Well, seeing I don't plan on stopping content, that's that's definitely not what's gonna happen. But I kind of I, I want to see how things kind of smooth out with with the whole Kappa situation before you know I do anything that may endanger the channel. However, if the channel does mysteriously poof out of thin air, um, I've still got Twitch, Mixer, and everything else, so you'll still see me around. Don't worry. Anyway. Anyways, um, what we have tonight is Vambrace, Cold Soul. I've been sleeping on this game for a while now. I've actually had it in my, my to-do list for a long time, but I was waiting until the things cooled down, things got a little bit colder, a little bit more wintry to really break this game out because it's based all around winter and the cold and ice and it really is a really cool looking game and I really really been really excited to play it. So anyway we're gonna go ahead and uh, jump in. Also there's an art gallery and I really want to see what all kinds of art they have. I'm hoping concept art and character turnarounds and background pieces that would be great. I really want to see what all we have here but let's just hope I survive that long. All right, let's go ahead and jump into a new game. What really stuck out to me most about this game is the art style. I really, really dig it. Like, I don't know any... I know a general idea what the gameplay is going to be like. But... Not sure about the fine details and I know a little bit about the story and oh we're already in okay okay no voice acting well fine then guess I gotta break up my chops I've been pretty good private bigs let's see I want a nice nice deep voice for this character uh, kind of a gruff uh, rough and tumble man all right this is the place I told you guys. Uh, this is the place I told you guys about. Private Wedge. I don't know. I'm imagining like the the my my gut reaction is to do another gruff voice, but honestly, I get the sense of like a a little bit softer of a of a person here, yeah? a little bit more uh, more reserved. Uh, he's a little bit shy because he's got his uh. His little helmet on, and he uh, doesn't doesn't really like uh, showing his face around to people very much. It's kind of a whispery uh, voice here. Looks like the spook got here first. Was it really worth leaving our regular path to come all the way out here? We're not patrolling today. Besides, if we don't find more supplies soon, we'll be in trouble. Have you a better suggestion? I'm not the uh, one that will have the have to tell. Is it Celeste? I guess it's Celeste. Ew, I like it. Celeste, we uh, came back empty-handed. Oh, great! It's a female. I can't do female voices. Why? Why game? Shut your pie house! You know what's lurking about here, up here. Just look around and see if you can find anything useful. Check out the tutorial graphic above and move out. That was a little fourth wall breaking. Okay, your character can move left to right on the field. Okay. 
the command box on the bottom left displays your interactive options with the environment around you. What do any of those mean? Oh, it's one, two, three, four. Okay. Uh, the command box on the bottom right displays the inventory, bio, codex, and map options. How do I access any of that? Is that map to? I'm assuming buttons. Can I do an MOP oppression? I mean, not really, because most of the cast are female. I mean, I definitely can't do Twilight. Like, I could maybe do a a male rarity or a male Applejack, but that's about it. I mean, I could try and do a Pinkie Pie, but, like, that's stretching my, my vocal range. Which, also, I've been trying to improve. And I think it's gotten pretty good. The inventory displays the items your team is carrying. The map displays your current location, destination, and field. I can't tell if that says encounter encounters? That looks like an A, but I'm assuming it's an E. The bio display wait, hang on, what? Inventory okay, I know what inventory is. Okay, map map's pretty self-explanatory. Bio displays your team members, stats and stuff. Okay, so that's that's basic knowledge. Okay. So how do I access any oh, okay okay so your team's inventory got it the skull icon represents hellion the currency used to buy and sell items the scale icon represents capacity and indicates how much your team can carry before suffering the overweight debuff each section of your inventory categorizes items by the same type hey there supersonic how you doing um Okay, for my... This is gonna be a really odd question. Okay, shoot, Anna. I guess for a male rarity, you'd want a bit more of an elegant... No, no, no. A bit more of an elegant uh, voice to him. And you'd want him to be a, a little bit hoity-toity with how he speaks and out of this bravado about him uh similar to a butler or perhaps a uh, british gentleman without the british accent but that's the best i can do for a male rarity um a pinky pie would probably be something like this where he's always so hyper and duper and oh so chipper but um let me think who el who else is left I mean, Applejack's basically just default country. It's just like, uh, you probably want to do something like this, you know, something a little bit more. You kind of got to give yourself that twang, and give yourself that that sudden drawl, kind of thing. But I feel like that's a little bit too high pitched, even for an Applejack. I feel like you'd want to take it down a little bit lower, see if you can get a little bit uh of that uh kind of. Kind of lower voice, almost, almost mixing a big Macintosh with just a higher pitch. Yeah, kind of give it that, that uh, kind of southern twang without really going too deep. Because if you go deeper, then that just makes it sound a little bit too weird, doesn't it? Makes him sound like a little bit of a uh, kind of more uh, bumpkin-y. Then uh, if you take it up a little bit notch, then uh, you kind of get uh, a, good, a good mixture between the two. Try Rainbow Blitz. Oh gosh, I had a... Rainbow Dash. She's a bit of a higher pitch, so you kind of have to go a little bit higher and kind of strain your um, your abdomen muscles to get that really high pitch noise out. Do you personally know anybody who's trans? Um, not to my not. Well, I do know a person that identifies as a male, but I don't know anyone that's actually gone through the surgery. Most items can be sold, uh, merchants removed from your inventory, however, quest items will remain with you. Relics represented by the diamond icon may be equipped to you improve stats or upgrade skills. Some quest items may also be equipped. Cool. Okay, so that's, uh... Scroll of Consent provides... 
Okay, what's... Scrap metal rope and other stuff. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's the map. Map displays current location. It's kind of self-explanatory. Nice, Asia. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of, like, that's honestly all you can do is just kind of make a Sonic impression. I don't know, because, like, we haven't really had a male dash to really base anything off of. And so that's why I just kind of go like this to kind of, you know, give her that extreme vibe, but also, you know, a little bit more, uh... I don't know, like, because I, I don't know what to base Dash's voice off of, because, like, when she talks, she's really high-pitched, you know, type, um, and she has, like, a voice cracky type thing, at least early on in the seasons, like, you know, when she says, oh, yeah, you know, type stuff, like, that's really high-pitched, and it's kind of, like, I can't, I can do that line, but I can't, like, I can't speak in that high a pitch, just because that's, way out of my vocal range. All right, anyway, we're we're going to Your progress has been saved. That doesn't uh, I don't like uh, I don't like when that Oh, I don't like that at all. Cuz usually that means something bad's about to happen. A door. Is it locked? Open it already. Keep your guard up. Interaction icons represent a variety of ways you can engage with the environment around you. A red X on the interaction icon means you can neither access the area nor engage with the object. You need to hold the interact button to complete your action with certain objects. Okay. Oh wait, we never checked our stats, did we? Yeah, we didn't check these. This is a bio. Learn more about your team members' stats, skills, status effects, and equipped relics here. Oh gosh, this is a lot of info. You can choose between the characters in your team. That's great. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of the thing with voice acting. And granted, I'm no, like, professional. I'd love to be a professional one day. Um, I'm thinking of making a voice reel for, uh, to submit to people, see if I can get a gig or something like that, just because it'd be fun. But, um, because I really like that, you know, I, I, I like to voice act. It's, it's fun to me to come up with voices and personalities for characters just out of a picture. Which, granted, I doubt that's how it actually is done in voice acting, I imagine. You know, you get a script, you kind of just make up a voice for said character, and then you're picked or not. Um, depending on how good you are at acting and all that. But, um, really wouldn't mind doing voice acting, just because it seems like just... I don't know. I never was a big acting kid when I was, you know, in school, like, middle school and high school and stuff. But... Like, as I've grown older, I've been like, I really want to do voice acting, which is weird, because I have stage fright, and I don't like to, like, get out on... I wouldn't want to get out on stage and act, but I don't know. I've also never tried that, so maybe I'd shine in that situation. I don't know. You never know something until you try it, right? Who do you think is the best pony? I don't really have a best pony. I just kind of like all of them. They're all just kind of... Kind of cool to my, I guess. The heart icon indicates health, and the flame icon indicates vigor. The sword icon indicates combat and represents the character's prowess at fighting. Block pig icon indicates slight and represents the character's ability to scavenge. Uh, indicates mercantry and represents the character's ability to negotiate with merchants. Awareness represents the individual's ability to spot traps. Uh, the party's success is determined by the ally with the highest rating. I don't know, mixed skills. I think if you just keep at it, you'll get there. I mean, I wasn't... Like, if you go back and watch my one of my first videos I uploaded, I was nasally, I was quiet... I did not exude enough, and I did not pronunciate a lot. It's just something you kind of learn and develop over time. 
it's like with any skill, like, say, art or music or anything like that. You kind of just, you adapt and get better and better and better, and that's how you improve, you know? I've been doing this for almost, golly, about eight years now, and I've been improving all those years, so, you know, it, it just takes time. And, you know, granted, sometimes I wish I could be a little bit faster at my improvement speed, but... You know, sometimes that's just how the ball rolls. Hey, I can wear a mask too. How you doing? The tent icon indicates Overwatch and represents the character's ability to care for the party while camping. Combat skills can be performed while fighting. Normal skills are your character's default abilities. The flourish skill can be used once it has been charged with flourish points. This section displays your party's equipment. You can check your equipment value. Wait, hang on. Volume benefit equipment. Okay. Use the formation button to change the arrangement of your uh, team members. You may need to dismiss a party member to recruit new comrades. Okay. Cool. So you're a paladin, I'm assuming. Can you get? Oh, what you are? Pray. Yeah, you're a paladin. Private wedge. Okay, you're a berserker. Uh, not a berserker. A um. Oh darn it! What's your barbarian? I guess. And you're okay. You're in the back. Okay, that's good. I think you're in the back. I'm gonna go with yes. All right. Well, no time like the present. Can you read a fanfic? I mean, I guess I could. I mean, is that something you guys would want to see? I found something. Looks like a chest of some sort. Well, oh, what are you waiting for? All right, here goes. I can't open it. Oh, you mean those big beefy man hands can't open a small little chest? What? Oh, mother help me. It's a miracle I survived this long in a company of fools. Just press and hold the button indicated in the tutorial graphic and voila! It's usually a good idea for, to have someone with a high sight stat in your team do the dirty work. Followed Equestria, good gravy. You mean the one where the main character is a female that I can't do? <laughs> I mean, it's like, I guess I could gender swap everybody that's female and just do male characters throughout the entire thing, but I think that kind of defeat a lot of purposes in that. <laughs> I don't know. I, I've been... I've honestly always toyed with the idea of doing, a, like, a Let's Read or Radio Play or something like that. Just to kind of see, like, what, like, if I could kind of thing, but I don't, I just don't know what to do with that. Like, I don't know what to read. I don't know if I'd necessarily do fanfics, just because those are long, long stories at times, but who knows. Containers like this may, be, may have valuable loot. A high slight will lead to better chances of finding loot. Chests will be opened by the party members with the highest slight. Scavengers with low sight may have difficulty opening chests and will often find less loot. I mean, hey, that guy still looks pretty happy. I read cupcake. Oh, gosh. Cool, I got... Uh... A toolbox. Okay, scrap metal. Wood planks. <coughs> The chests here are different from the ones back in 
Edina? Does it say Edina? Edina? Forget the chest. Try checking your inventory and character bios as indicated in the bottom right corner of the screen. Wow, okay, Miss Fourth Wall Break. Yeah, this is all new. That's fine, but what doesn't do anything for me. So wait, can I go back? How about a Rainbow Dash story? No, I can't go that way. Can I run? Is there any... Is there any run button? There is not a run button. That I know of. It's freezing in here. You think the spooks are going close? Do you forget to bring the... Oh gosh, what is that word? Geistometer? 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 Again? Whatever that word is. See, that's another thing. Is it's like, on made-up words like this, I'm like, what the heck does this even mean? How do you even pronunciate that? Geistometer? I, whatever. It's a gigameter thing. Geistometer, I guess. Because, like, poltergeist? Because he talked about spooks. So I'm assuming poltergeists. So, geistometer? I, I don't know. We should keep going. No use going back the way we came if they are. Stay put for too long and you'll catch up. And they'll catch up. Remember, if your health and or vigor drops to zero... We'll be the- we'll be the ones spooking this place, let's go! I feel uneasy, this place gives me the creeps. The red bar on the character's HUD indicates health. If a character's health drops to zero, he or she will die. Damage to health- damage to health is usually indicated during com- and incurred during combat. Yellow bar on the character's HUD indicates vigor. A character will also die if Vigor drops to zero. Da uh, damage to Vigor is usually incurred through the stress of exploration. You gain Flourish points through critical action bonuses and fi finishing turns during combat. Accumulating enough will activate your Flourish. What does a Flourish do then? Infracted Totem, what? You spring a trap that spreads infrasonic waves, causing you to stagger, uh, causing, causing you a strange tension. Minus two health and tremor. Another trap. Best have someone with a high awareness tat in your team to avoid them. Got plans for the new year? Hey there, Kay! How you doing? Honestly, I mean, other than the the plans I outlined in my 2020 video, not really. Like, I've got currently plans to do a webcomic, short animated uh, animation, a um, animated series slash kind of franchise, I guess? I don't know. Um, similar to what uh, Vizzy's doing with uh, has been, basically, but on a probably much lower scale for the time being, just because it's going to be only me uh, doing everything for the time being, um, other than maybe hiring voice actresses and whatnot. But, um... Other than that, did I say webcomic? I'm pretty sure I said webcomic already. But those are mainly the big, big things that I plan on doing. Um, plan on bringing in more art streams again. Um, probably will start doing that every, like, basically Mondays and Wednesdays. I want to kind of do a, like, alternation. Like, Monday do gaming, Wednesday do art, Monday do gaming, Wednesday do art kind of thing. But I haven't quite 
deduced how I want to do the the schedule for it and kind of plan everything out I mean I might do Fallout New Pegasus I didn't know that the male character that was a male character but I might do that then I don't know if if a like reading if a if a reading session is what you guys want then I will see what I can do Traps are a dangerous feature of Ice Mari. Mari? Ice Nari? Your party leader or the entire team could incur damage from an activating a trap. Characters with high awareness warn your party of imminent, imminent danger and allow you to avoid unexpected casualties from traps. Characters with low awareness will trigger traps more easily. Some actions have a probability of failure. When you see this green script, it means your attempt was successful. The red script means the action failed, and you will incur a penalty. The gray script means you missed, and the enemy has evaded your attack. The blue script means that you scored a critical, and your action's effe effects have been maximized. Okay. Hang on, let me... About the chat, because I'm having a hard time reading it. Whatever loads. Or it could just not. There we go. Um, no, it has nothing to do with MLP at all. It is my own original story with original characters and original stuff. So, it's got nothing to do with MLP whatsoever. Because, A, I don't want to have copyright issues, and B, just not what I want to do. I just saw something move in the distance. Get your weapons ready, and think fast. Let's make sure you won't get home today. I'm ready. Well, don't you all look lovely and angry. Very angry. You have encountered hostile enemies. Your team is located on the left, and your enemy team is positioned on the right. Each team has four slots rising in value from the center. The team's characters are the center. The team's character HUDs have slot icons denoting their space. The bottom bar displays turn order. Using the character HUD slot icons, a higher awareness gives characters an advantage in initiative. If two characters have the same awareness, then one uh, the one positioned in front will get initiative. Normal skills are your character's default abilities. With Flourish, uh, the Flourish is powerful, but needs to, char to be charged by accumulating Flourish points. Use Guard... Using guard is a useful way to defend against powerful attacks. You may even get a flourish point. You cannot use items or change relics during combat. However, you may check the map and bio for the benefits of planning your next move. So wait, you can't use health potions? That's kind of odd, but okay. Formation allows you to rearrange your team in the heat of combat. Runaway will al is also a good option for avoiding combat. Monster types are indicated by the icon beneath their portraits. Some skills may incur special effects based on these types. Okay. So what is that typing mean? Is that is that the HUD? Okay, I guess do that. There are three uh, three range types for every skill: short range, mid range, and long range. Short range skills are only available while positioned in the first or second slot and can only target enemies in the first or second slots of their own uh, line. Mid range skills can be used in any position but can only target enemies in the first and second slot. Long range skills can be used to target anybody. Use your target. Your target's reticle is visible on the enemy HUD. You can also speed up the pace of the combat. I want to hit the lady in the back, since she's the only one that can do that. Oh, well, she died. Okay, I'm 
gonna hit you. Oh, you died. Hey, he's fine. But so is she. What is... It's probably read what each skill does for each character. Probably a good thing to do. Probably, probably should do that. Okay, so let me actually read what these attacks and skills are. So strike, okay, that's self-explanatory. Heal self for health and receive inspired status. Four plus one combat for two turns. War cry, deal one true damage. I think that's what that says. It's a little bit hard to read. To three long range rangers and attract them in the range. Targets receive combat two or minus two for one turn. Okay. Oh, wrong button. I forget how to. There we go. Um, strike, battle roar, deal one true damage to one long range target. Target receives powerless status for combat, minus four for one turn. Okay. Whirlwind, deal one true damage to two mid range targets. Okay. Rally, all targets and allies receive plus one health, inspired stats, and one combat. And flying shuriken and thrust can do. On mid range, but we don't have her at mid range right now. Yes, this is inspired by Dark's Dungeon, if you couldn't tell. I told you guys I have a bad feeling about this place. Wait, which one's which? Because he's blacked out, so that means Private Wedge is up. You're the one who insisted we come on here to begin with. By all means, continue quarreling amongst yourselves if you want to be, night, be ice pops. We have the spoils we came for, and it's colder than a witch's... Um... Thing out here. I, for one, am ready to return. Hold up, guys. I see a body. It looks like a girl. What is it? Or who is it? I don't know. It looks dead to me. <laughs> She's not from Dalrich. I wouldn't recognize her. No other scavenging team carry up, uh, came up here today. Well, we can't help her now. Search the body. Seriously? You search her. Wait, she's still breathing. We should help her. Who knows how long we've, she's been out here. Do you want to bring her back? Are you mad? You have no clue who she is. She could be with the green flame, for all we know. She doesn't look like one of them. We can't risk com compromising Dalroch's location. Celeste will have our heads, and what if she knows how to cast that strange magic? We don't have to worry about that. She's unconscious, Captain Levani. Not decide her fate. Looks like it's your lucky day, girl. Yes, this game is like a RPG. I once read, a man would have to go below the waves to understand the true scale of an iceberg. Reminds me of you, dear father. I confess, I never really knew you. After all, how does one get the measure of a man when there's so much beneath the surface? Nevertheless, I owe my survival of Zumurud's blistering deserts and the wild forests of Sylvia to your training. When I was summoned home to Edina, in order to read your last will and testament, I didn't know what to expect. I suppose it comes as no surprise you remained a mystery even in death. I now find myself beckoned to the dwarven realm of Darkheim by the encrypted journal and ancient relic you left behind. On an expedition to the cursed city of Isenair, answers you never provided. I shall not be daunted. My determination is equal to the task at hand. 
If, as you say, this Vambrace is the key to entering that Forbidden City. I will find what I seek. My journey has been difficult. Since the Vambrace entered my possession, I have been plagued by unsettling dreams of a ghostly blade cutting me down. Well, if that don't make me intrigued. Also, very nice cinematic. Because in my TV in real life, I actually have like little figurines on it on my entertainment center. So I decided to put them on there. This is quite a long load screen. I wonder what to be on the other side. <coughs> ah! <coughs> oh, my head. Glad well, you can join us, Sleeping Beauty. Who are you? Let's make this clear. I'm the one asking questions here. You can start with your name. My name's Lyric. The failure Lyric. I'm Lanville es Esquire. And luckily I found you. A moment later and you would have been another piece of frozen decor gracing the streets. Or the streets. Streets of... I must have fainted. I've never felt a chill like that before. We are unfortunately well acquainted with that here. Celeste has half a mind to leave you up there. Good for you. She's not calling the shots, and I'm feeling generous. Up there? So, we're underground. Looks like I got a sharp one on my hands. I took the liberty of searching your stuff. A bunch of climbing gear and a strange book nobody can read. Explain. I came seeking answers about my father, the late Dr. Nicolu Lyric. I traveled here from Edina with this journal. Right. Everyone knows nobody goes and then nobody ever comes out of Ice Nor. I just know what you mean. I'm here. I actually made it inside the city. I suppose for a moment I entertain your absurd story. How the heck did you get past the forest fell? That barrier around the city? I walked through it. Enough of that nonsense. You think I haven't seen what happens when someone touches it? Instant death! The only freaks wandering the surface are either spooks, mad survivors, or the green flame. You're not dead, and far as I can tell, you're still sane, so let's cut through the garbage. What's your connection with the green flame? Green what? Green flame. The Arconic Cult. Hell-bent on destroying the Guardian Alliance. Ring any bells? Have you been living under a rock? They're the ones responsible for this frozen curse? I can assure you I am not with them. I just got here. You're serious, aren't you? Well, imagine my surprise to learn some Edeen did it. Decided to take a leisure stroll on the surface. Listen, I have a matter of great urgency. I'm looking for an individual named 
Zaguad. Do you know of him? <laughs> There's nothing left of us to discuss right now. But I'm feeling generous today, so tell you what. I'm going to... I'm giving you tentative permission to move about it. Delarge, until I figure out what to do with you. Delarge. Oh, that's the name of our lovely abode deep below Isnar. Welcome to paradise. You're just letting me go? There's nowhere to run. You'd best make yourself at home. In fact, take this. You'll need some if you want to survive down here. What's this? We call it Hellion. It's the only currency worth anything down here. Consider it a little welcome gift. I've never seen paper money. If anything funny and you're dead in a cell or right back on this surface where you we found you. Is that clear? Crystal. I'm famished. Is there anything to eat down here? You can run while you're in ZR and that. Okay. This is the Codex Illum Illumis. It's separated into two sections, the Codex and Journal. Change books in the view to, the, to view the journal. And it contains details on your current mission and goal. You can choose from the Completed Work Mission section. Completed Immersion. Okay, so. Cool. Running works. Um, the book. Yeah, this is the Codex. Uh, it's separated into two sections. Yeah, you, we already went through that. Um, Lyric inherited the Codex from her father. Unlock its encrypted pages to learn more about the world, its history, and other mysteries. History and other mysteries. It rhymes. You can toggle between Codex categories and check the pages within. Change books to view the journal. It's, uh, it contains details on your current mission and goals. You can choose between completed and working mission sections. School. Let's note. Okay, exit the prison. Find somewhere to eat. <laughs> I can do that. Man, that's a whole lot of good stuff right here. Anything over here? Nope. Cool. What up? Oh, thanks, Raiden. See you later. The captain finished with you, eh? That was fast. Please, wait while I process your paperwork. How long I gotta wait? Did I... I'm gonna look at this thing. I keep your body warm. Step one, make fire. Step two, stand in front of fire. Step three, be warm. That's a pretty good three-step plan right there. Hey, you! You look all dark, foreboding, and or have a tragic backstory. Let's talk! Keep your distance from her. Or you are bound to lose a limb. That's Isabel Salazar. The woman knows black magic. Consider yourself warned. Can't place her, but for some reason, she looks... Oh, familiar. Sup? So, how you doing? Are you my well-endowed goth GF? I think you was. The frost wind howls around you. you pre your presence here will bring much anguish. What? I don't understand. Your paperwork's done. Scram before we change our minds. Can I talk to you? Let's keep your distance from her. Uh, uh, whatever. I want to be hexed. Screw. Oh, I'm a little tiny little child. Oh, it's so cute. Okay. Man, my progress is always being saved. That's. That's concerning! Because that means I've got more options to mess up. What, what the heck is all this? 
I just went to his next explanation point. Oh, look at the people! Alt! You're not permitted to be roaming around here. Calm yourself, good sir. This is my dear friend. Don't you recognize him? Another girl, eh? You tricky jerk. I still need to check her papers, though. Ah, no need to, brother. I can personally vouch for her. After all, I f a friend of mine is a friend of the North Venture Company. All right, all right, go on. Who's that smooth talker? Hello. What gorgeous eyes the lady has. Maharm, relic hunting extraordinaire at your service. Sorry, but isn't that just a fancy way of saying you're a thief of antiques? You offend my sensibilities with such barbaric words. I am merely a humble adventurer who got stuck in the wrong place at the wrong time. Thanks for defending me at the market gates, but my or my name's Lyric. Why did you help me anyway? I have a quick ear, my lady. Life here can be a difficult for an outlander unfamiliar with our strange ways. Ah, forgive me. You must be famished. Allow me to take you to the market. That's one offer I won't refuse. Come then, follow me. Hello, oh, Yosu. This is Lyric, my dear friend, since uh, <laughs> today. He's gawking at me. Yasu, huh? That's a pretty name. How can I help you do today? Do you have anything to eat? I can pay in gold. You don't use gold here, milady. Don't you have any hellion? Hellion? The fox here. Tra the fox here traditionally burnt. The fox. Oh, what? What the heck's a fox ear? Is that you? Is that your race? That's cool. <laughs> Tales of Vesperia is pretty good. I will say that. So I mean, it's kind of. It's kind. Of, it, that is a hard decision to make. The fox ear traditionally burnt it as an offering to an, our ancestors. It's now the currency of choice for spooks. You mean this, right? Lavo gave me this. Great. I'm gonna make you a deal. Anything I'm particularly looking for? The largest survivors and so uh, survivors in sober race conduct trade using a paper currency called a hellion. You need to scavenge and sell supplies you found on the field to earn more. Switch between the shop wares and your inventory and to buy and sell items. Mercantory represents your ability to negotiate with merchants. More options and rare items will appear in the shop if you have a high mercantory stat. Okay. Splint. How much money do I have? I have 5,000 or 500 bucks. Okay, we got Gecko on a tail. Sylvia tree. Centipede stick. Fox syrup, and smelling salts, and fire brew. All right, let's see what each thing do. Set pesky broken bones. Healing process. Okay. Can I get? I'm assuming this is my stuff. Can I get one of these? Tastes good, but it's very isn't very nutritious. A tea brewed from the highland leaves of Sylvia. A great way to sober up and recuperate. 
Okay, can I take two of these? Man, like, that's plus one vigor. That's minus one vigor. Well, which one to do? Vox syrup. The syrup uh, concoction smooths the throat and brings out the music in your voice. Cures hoarse and sleepy. Use, usable while camping. Okay, I'll buy two of those. And smelling salts. Smells are around the conscious of weird travelers. Cures faint and hallucinating. I'll buy three of those. Good gravy, will I? I don't think I could. I think I'd die before I finish them all. Because are we talking 100% or just story? Because even either way, so uh, gosh. Like, love the Tales series. But I just can't. <laughs> the infamous Nazari drink burns all the way down. It keeps your body warm and gives you liquid courage. Here's terrified and frostbitten by one of those. Oh, I'm completely over encumbered. Okay. Um, okay, I. No, 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 no. But I can't. Wait. There we go. Okay. Let me sell. I guess one of these. I guess one of these. I guess one of these. That way I've got a little bit more room. I'll be seeing you around. Well, hello there, pretty lady. How are you? Stop right there! Lady Celeste, what brings you to our quaint corner of Delray? What are you doing out of prison? Mayhaps there is a misunder... Shut your mouth, Mar... Mahoram? I don't know what that... I don't know if that's supposed to be an insult or if that's his name, but arrest her anyway! What? <laughs> hmm. Back again, I see. Honestly, I... I honestly didn't think you were gonna make it when you... when we dumped you in that cell. Celeste, right? Lanville mentioned your... Uh, your team found me. Save the pleasantries. I don't trust you as far as I can throw you. Regardless, you have my thanks. You received no charity from us. My team found you on the street. Thought you might be a green flame agent we could interrogate. Good intel is hard to come by nowadays. I understand everyone's suspicious, but I already told Lanville I have no connection to them. Am I to believe you just waltzed into ice and ice nerf? Uh, ridiculous. Yeah, there's a dragon quest catch again. The frost fell surrounding this city kills anything that touches it. You have is we have Isabel to thank for that wretched gift that keeps giving. I saw her in the prison. What does she have to do with all this? You can stop playing coy. I'm not buying your act, lady. If what Landville said is true, I'm the first person to enter the city in years. Nobody outside has the slightest clue of what's happening here. Want to know what really happened? We were the fools that got caught in the middle of a civil war. Between who? Tensions between the dwarfs and drifters is, all, is as old as the city itself. We never managed to... We never imagined Ice Nair would devolve into total chaos. The green flames have been here stoking tensions for months if not years. When the, time, when the time came, they seized the moment and orchestrated a, a divisive coup. So, in whose name? The King of Shades. He cursed this place and keeps an iron grip on it. 
I'm sure you're not surprised to... That's no surprise to you. After all, you show up now? That's a convenient. Maybe Lanville believes your little sob story, but you're not fooling me. You've got the wrong idea about me. I came here in good faith. Too bad you're mar marching right back into that prison cell and you're not going to learn to get real... C and you're going to learn to get real cozy with that witch friend of yours. Ma'am, we have a problem. Can't you see I'm in the middle of something? There's a mad wraith in Delrich. What? How's that possible? It's that ascending room. It's the ascending room. Please come. Just my luck. Don't think this changes anything. You're coming with me. That rumor about the mad wraiths of Icemere be true? Uh -huh, probably. Oh, he done killed a lot of people. Everybody stay back. That's no ordinary spook. It's gone mad. <laughs> Watch out! And just like that, I killed it. Celeste, what's going on here? Captain, it appears some spooks hitched a ride to Delridge in the ascending room. Who was on duty? We lost two souls here. There are no witnesses as to how they got in, sir. We arrived a moment too late. Lyric stopped it. Is that so? I guess your theory that she was the green flame didn't age well. What say you now? I, uh... Sir, we shouldn't jump to any conclusions. Nonsense. Get these men to this... To the Sil Sylvanal Hewing Hill healing hall and be discreet about it. We don't need co to cause an unnecessary panic and post some guards on the surface. Lyric, meet me in the war room at the Guardian's barracks. There's something we would like to word with you. Well, okay, fine. I'll just go there then. Is this the barracks? I'm guessing this is the barracks. I'm gonna go in here. Hey! I said you'd come here. They're waiting for you in in what room? In this room? This looks like a closet. This is not a. This is the barracks. This this the barracks. Ooh, what's in here? Ooh. I don't know. I need to go see. What's this? Aha! Uh -huh. You found a page of the codex. Neat. Weird, but neat. <laughs> I found a page of the codex. I'm gonna pay the codex! If that's how I find pages of codex, I've got a real. Oh, it, it, it just might be. You all have a problem then, because I am not gonna. I, I am gonna sit here and twiddle my whittle all throughout the entire place finding pages, man. You're in trouble. Everybody's in trouble. Oh, there's no more pages, it seems. Alright, well. Wait, is that a room I can go in? Hang on. There's a room at the hall. At the end of the hall, let me see if I can... Oh, I can. Once again, they've made a grave error. Huh. A grave error indeed was made this day. Sup, Celeste? How you doing? You ice-cold lady? I could say other mean words, but I don't feel like that would get my point across. Wait! Oh, no, wait, I already went through there. Sup! Oh, oh okay. I thought, I thought it was cutscene. Aha! Uh -huh, now I'm invisible! You can't see me! Aha! Uh -huh, I was there all along! Alright, I actually want to look at this codex. Hmm? Oh, 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 gee, oh, geez. I forget that I don't use the 
D-pad to move around. Ooh, myths. I'm interested in the lore of this world. I feel like... Like, I feel like this is, like, a really good D&D &D campaign, you know? Like, it's got all this good lore that you can just get. And I really want all of it just in my mouth. I guess this book. Ascending Room. What the heck was that? The Ascending Room is a marvel of ancient dwarven engineering. The room functions as a lift that ferries passengers from Dalrich to the surface of Icemore. It follows a complicated network of tunnels underground that serves to conceal the room's final destination. This renders Dalrich's location virtually impossible to find unless it's accessed via the Ascending Room. Despite the machine's age, it is far more advanced than most modern technology in Etheria. Ethera? Eth Ethra? Uh, most motor uh, knowledge used for the construction. Okay, cool. So that's actually like an elevator room. It, it is literally an ascending room. Got it. Gee, thanks. I don't feel dumb anymore. All right. There, there's a couple more pages I've missed, but I'm, I'm not gonna split hairs. This is a city map. Cool. Awesome. So I'm assuming I talk to you, pretty boys. Oh, my feet hurt. Oh, my foot's asleep. Oh, my both my feet are asleep. Oh, get the blood flowing. Oh gosh. I don't know how it happened, sir, but we've been making every effort. Oh, Rick, glad you could join us. I'd like to introduce you to our esteemed leader. Zaquad Venture. Zaquad, I set out in search for a few months ago. I can hardly believe you're standing here now. Oh, please excuse m me. Uh, apologies for interrupting. I'm just pleased to make your acquaintance, sir. Alrighty, Shadow. See you later, my man. Please call me Z. Zagwa, the captain just informed me of your usual, unusual arrival. I have a lot of questions, but they'll have to wait. Yes, I'm sorry to cut the introduction short, but we have an ongoing situation. Isabel Salazar escaped her cell and left Dalrich. She murdered our guards and allowed a mad wraith into Dalrich. Putting many lives at risk. I saw her briefly while having my paperwork done. She even spoke uh, to me as I was leaving. What? She hasn't spoken in a year. Do you remember what she said? I didn't pay much heed to her at the time. Who is she? That witch is one of the Shade King's prime lieutenants. If she gets away, she will come... Compromise Dalrich's location. If that happens, nothing will save us. Then forgive me for asking, but why aren't you pursuing her right now? We tried. We were unable to follow her through the frost fence. Uh, through the frost, frost fence, though. She used her magic to bypass it. Frost fence? That, uh... I still haven't decided on a voice for this guy. Like, I'm... I'm getting kind of, a. Uh... A little, kind of just chill dude. Just because of the hair, mostly. But, like, I don't know. I don't know if that's accurate. Yeah, whatever. There's a small barrier conjured from some magic at the Frostfell. A green flame used them to limit our access to the certain sectors of Eisner. They too are deadly to the touch. But that wouldn't be an issue for you, would it, Lyric? Sir? It's true, I walked through the Frostfell. I could do so through the power of this Vem Brace, but you already knew that, didn't you? How'd you come into possession of that artifact? 
My late father left it for me. His final letter did uh, bid me to seek you out in this cursed place. The fan brace, he said, was the key to coming here. It allowed me to bypass the Frostfell harmlessly. Would your father happen to be esteemed Dr. Nicolou Lyric? One and the same. How could you possibly know that? He's a renowned scholar, and his research on the Archons is unsurpassed. I'm well versed on his works. Now, before we... Uh, now, before me stands a woman bearing his namesake and carrying a relic of Archonic design. Even if I, even I can connect the dots. You recognize this thing? It's called the Aether, Aether Brace. A powerful relic indeed. I'm not sure Lyric realizes the value of what she possesses. If, if all you say is true, then she should give it to us. Or she should give it to us. We could use it to turn, this, to turn the tide against the King of Shades. It's not that simple. I can't remove it. I've tried everything short of cutting off my arm. Why, Rick, you seek answers, and I'm willing to help you. But our priority now is finding Isabel. Would you be willing to lead a party past the frost fence to find her? This isn't my first tracking mission. I'll help, but when I come back, we need to talk. You will need a place to prepare before deploying. Take the scroll of consent and tell Helga at the Lost Lady Inn I sent you. She'll make sure you have a space. My scouts informed me Isabel was moving north towards the entertainment district. We'll send some guardians with you to the surface to help, of course. If you're looking for cell swords, you might have some luck at the recruitment board. In the meantime, I will s make sure the ascending room is set for your next destination. Leave it to me. Radio, Daddy-o! Get the heckin' Minecraft out of here. <clears throat> well, hello there, Mr. Fancy Pants. I think I'll go with a snobby... Like, he just seems like a snob. So I'm gonna go with a, a snobby... Um... No, no, that's too... That's too, like... Hmm... A snobby. No, 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 no. Snobby. A snobby. Hey, girl, over here. Uh... I'm pretty busy right now. Then I'll keep it brief. I'm Maru Han, the acting director of the North Venture Company in Dokal. I heard a rumor Lenville was... Assembling an expedition to the entertainment district. Is it true? Well, it travels fast around here. There are few activities to, well, to while away the hours in Delrich, and the gift of the garb has always been my specialty. Well, your sources were right, but the original expedition was cancelled in my leading the new one myself. Then I have a specific request that an item of great importance be in the entertainment district. To me, bring... There is an item of great importance to be in the entertainment district. The merchant Manduk is currently in possession of it. What is this item and who is Manduk? A golden seal called the Osa. Oksa. It is granted by Asan... Asando... Asa... Good gravy, all these words! Asaldali. The Asaldali Emperor and confers the legitimacy of its owner to conduct business on behalf of the North Venture Company in Doka. Malduk was the company's former chief. This doesn't seem like something worth risking lives over. Risk brings reward. Fetch me that seal, and I'll ensure you get the finest deals in Dalrich. 
You'll need my help if you're planning regular expeditions to the surface. Alright, I'll keep an eye out for it, but I'm not making any promises. The merchant's fate has already been sealed. It is, at, it is of little use to her now, but it is priceless to me. I'll be seeing you around. You most certainly will. Okay, where do I go now? Okay, where's the recruitment halls? This, this is, I assume. The heck is this? Terrifying, happy smace, finally, man. Wow, are these good stories about machines? But I've never seen one up close. Oh boy! Yoink. This is Lyric's cabinet. You can store items from your inventory here. You can access items you've stored from the cabinet located in Volsvig's workshop and market as well. Neat. I guess I'll talk to the first big bot here. Guess not. Talk to this guy. Huzzah, you're a mist. Or be a mist. There's no other technical marvel like them in the world. Yeah, that they're quite remarkable. Did you make them yourself? The name's Volsug. This is my workshop. Yep, the faithful servant of the hands of the handiest. Have you ever met a golem before? A golem? Ha! I'm not surprised. The, in the Adenia don't have the same no knack for engineering we do. No offense, of course. There's a lot of complex tech running underneath the hood of these tin men. The inside compartments in my, is my... Uh, well, you're quite the handyman. How do they work? These superior golems are powered by my special brand of engineering and a bit of Sylv Sylvanis hinge, hedge magic. They run on enchanted apples who bad Tal Talendra won't help me anymore. Now you'll excuse me, I got work to do. Okay. Well, gee, that was helpful. And by helpful, I mean not at all. Do any of these things talk? Guess there's no point of being here. Oh, maybe it was in the, the place next door. I don't know. Then where is this... Why is there a, a exclamation point near this place? If there's nothing I can do here. Okay, well that place is blocked off. Okay, so I know I gotta go there. The the I'm assuming that's the inn. Maybe it's not. Maybe because uh, I'm looking for the recruitment board, but maybe. Hey, you here? Hello, boss lady. Ed, what's up? How you doing? Oh, wait. Taking that. Oh, look at that. A happy gestury duo. That's what I'm assuming. It, it definitely seems like it. Speaking of... Do I have... Do I have any... I don't have any equipment. Do I? Does not appear it. That's not good. But I don't know where to get any equipment. So. Payton's lost lady puppet. We have come to my attention that it may... 
Many of you have been leaving empty mugs and bottles strewn about the premise just because it's... The apocalypse doesn't mean you have to act like beasts. Please do your part in keeping the lost lady clean. Oh, that's nice. Well, hello there, lady in the back. As a prisoner of a fellow adventurers. That's quite the sixth sense you have there. Name's Lyric. Who might you be? No offense, but I'm not looking for new friends. There is end up six feet under. That's a jagged outlook. Survive a few trips to the surface and maybe we'll have something in common. See then. Your guard up. Hmm, okay. Keep her in mind later. Oh, those are beds. Okay, makes sense. Then what's in... Oh, I can't go in that room. Well, it doesn't seem like there's anything else for me to do, so I will sit here and talk. Are you Elka? Well, look who... What a snowcat dragged in. I heard that there was a new face in town. My name's Lyra. The Zangard sent me his reg uh, sends his regards. He said you could set me up with a room here? That's, um... Unfortunately, we're full up. Oh. Actually, I might have something for you. But it can hardly be called a room. Used to roughing it. I have my share of nights without a roof over my head. And you won't have any problem here. You have a space behind the bar that's barely that's being used for storage. You can know, unload over there. I'm not complaining. Make yourself at home. Feel free to spruce it up. Huh. Well, she just feels all kinds of agreeable. I'd be kind of like, well... Fine. Oh, wait, I'm assuming I have to actually go outside? Then? I kind of... Oh, nope, never mind. It's this door, I guess. Is this the place? Can't tell. It... Yep. Oh, she wasn't kidding. This place is a dump. Hey, you take what you get. Well, if I'm gonna stay here, I might as well clean up a bit. Well, hey, there we go. Now this place looks great. It took all night to clean that mess, but I have to admit, this place looks a lot better now. Really not half bad. About time to head out. I should check the recruitment board. Glanville mentions uh, to see if I can find some hands for the expedition. Blaze. Oh, wait, can I? Oh, Lyra can change her clothes in the dressing room. You will unlock new skins as you progress through the expedition. Nice. Oh, I'll keep my my stuff on here. Hmm. Well, since I slept in a proper bed, it looks like it's about to fall apart, but I'd rather take my chances than sleep on the cold stony ground. Look at the flames relaxes me. The fireplace really brings some welcome warmth to my straight to my stay here. This place doesn't look half bad now. Uh -huh. This is my storage unit, so I'll keep my stuff in here. The space in my pack is limited, and my companions won't be able to bring much either. If I carry too much, I won't be able to continue the expedition to the best of my ability. Huh. And what's this? A bath with running water? Impressive. The ancient aqueduct system here is much more advanced than most modern cities. Wait, I can take a bath? Does that give me any buff? Or is it just for aesthetic? I, I guess it's just for aesthetic. Well, cool! Maybe it relaxes me or something. I don't know. Okay, where do I go to grab more people? Maybe downstairs where the, the beds are? There's this big old board. No? Well, fine then.
Ah, it's, uh, it's over here. All right. This looks like the recruitment board. Let's see if any hired hounds are available. I know it said hands, but I like hounds better. Oh, look at the fox people. Oh, they're so cute. You meet up with your new hires, the lost lady, before going at the surface. Always helps to put a name to the face. Thanks for the tip. This is the recruitment board. You will find willing comrades in Dalrich who have added their names here. Select comrades to join your expeditions to the surface. There are only four con uh, conditions now, or candidates now. But you will unlock more allies as you progress. New applicants will appear on the recruit board from time to time. Okay, so I can pick three. Our caster. Great range spreads damage. Okay. Okay, yeah, there's just one page. So, dragon. Great. Polar. I can't even read that. Can I actually get like a. Uh, well, can I. Can I like look at them at all? Okay, well, I. I, I want to try you. You. get you. Alright. Alright, I actually want to go, uh, I, I want to go meet him. See if I can. Oh, well. Speak of the devil. There's a lot of curious, uh, curiosities up there. We should dig around for something good. Try not to lose your ba bearings the first time you get to see a spook cookie. Gee, thanks. Still oh so great. Oh wait, there's there's the guy. Oh no, nope, I went down the stairs. Oi! Oi! <laughs> Oi! <laughs> I didn't have those bloody idiots. Let that witch escape. Hey, keep your voice down. You don't need to cause an unnecessary panic. Hey. Right. So, uh, wrong area. Okay, hey, so, I actually want to go in and... So can I actually, oh, I actually have to, okay, hang on. You go in here. Can I access my party arrangement? Does not look like I can, but I can at least look at my teammates here. Bullseye! Deals combat damage. Okay, so you're arranged. I should keep you in the back. You're. I'm going to pitch you up front. And I'm going to put you in the middle. Okay. Okay, here we go. So... I'm going to... What the heck do I do? Wait, hang on. I should probably learn what I do. Okay, so... What do is... Nope. No, oh, okay, that, that's that's fine. You... Backity back. You right there. Put me in second. There we go. That should do us. Now, should I go to the marketplace? See if I can get any equipment. Is the deal of the day here. Ah. 
Okay, so he's got stuff. Okay, let me see if there's any more. Fresh off the boat from Eden. I don't believe we've met. I learned that I'm N Nare Song. I'm Larik. What's the North Venture Company still doing here? Conducting business as usual, no less? What? We're doing as anything but business as usual. In any case, you'd be surprised how durable the age old tenets of supply and demand are. How's that possible in a place like this? Some spooks in Icemere are still going about their daily lives. They trade supplies from their vast stores of Icemere. We don't have access to And what could a spook possibly want in return? Helium, the only currency worth anything, is in this forsaken waste. Spooks won't accept gold. Luckily for us, we're the only ones capable of printing authentic Hellion. Interesting. Wasn't Hellion originally meant to be used as burnt offering from the Foxier to their ancestors? That's true. They can't make, make it for themselves. You seem familiar with our culture. I guess it's no surprise you're carrying such a nice crossbow. I've never seen anything like it. Well, it's nothing like a traditional fox ear bow, but it is on my own making. But it is of my own making. We should visit the range someday and fire off a few shots. I like her a lot. You got spunk. The Backening Fox, a traditional statue is common talisman of luck for fox ear. Cool, foxy lady. Rub the fox. I don't know. What you, I don't know what you do. Point is, do it. Give us luck. I have a feeling we're all going to die. Man, they are printing money. Literally. What's in here? Did I come in here? I did not. Oh, hey, it's my suave friend. Ah, oh, Lyric. Why are you idling in such a place? Wing for you, of course. That sweet talk won't work on me, Mer... Maharam... Wait, is that a nudie? Look. Is that... Uh, oh, it's a hot spring ad. It's conveniently... Censored by the, uh, uh, bookcase. Nice. Nice. Alright. Guess we'll buy what we can and... Ah. Let's see, portable herbal kit. Let's take one of those. How much, actually? Oh, yeah, that's, that's a onezer. Oof. All right, give me one of those. I haven't seen any. I got that yet. Huh. Okay, yeah, no. Okay, let me, I mean, I have no money, so it doesn't really matter. But can I really not buy any, like, equipment or anything? Like, I've got... Absolutely nothing. I'm hoping this team ha already comes equipped. Like, I'm assuming. But also, you know what they say about assuming. But, like, I don't know where else to get anything. Because, like, this guy doesn't sell anything. And this would be the place I'd think you'd pick up equipment. So I'm gonna just go out there and probably die. But it's fine. Totally fine. 
Oh, they won't die. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. So it changes me because I'm... He's up front. Okay, this is it. Once we head up there, there's no going back. Let's go. I don't want it no more. We have a job to do. Ascending room. The ascending room is an ancient device constructed to ferry passengers from Dalrich to various locations on the surface of Iceland. Choose your destination and go. Part under them. Ready? Oh, let's go to the entertainment district. And see what wonders wait for you. Looks like this is the hidden entrance to the city. I could freeze to death up here. I'd better hustle if I want to find Isabel. Camping is essential to restoring your party's health and vigor. Your party will be able to set su use supplies during this lull in your expedition. Make sure you take the time to benefit from planning accordingly. You need to choose someone to oversee the camp. This person will manage supplies and security and morale while the party is resting. It is usually a good idea to choose someone with high overwatch. Your chosen overwatch can amuse the party with song and story to restore vigor. Success is determined by the overwatch stat. The Overwatch will guard the camp while your party chooses to rest. Sleep will restore the health, and success is determined by the Overwatch stat. Shadowmancers and fencers can be can use ravens to scout streets in your current neighborhood, thus revealing what you can ex expect to encounter there. Okay, so who has high Overwatch? Three, two, one. You're gonna be the watching lady. Knew there was a reason I picked you. Not just for the fox ears and tail. No. That would be silly. I would never do that. Ever. Hmm. 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 Never. Never in a million years. Pretty cute fox too. Da. Ah. Gee, thanks, carbonated water. You, you just decided to splurge all over me. That's grand. Okay. You. So. Sorry, just drank like a bit of carbonated water. A little burpy. I'm Sarge Zarquard. I'm Sarge. Zarquard told me you were coming up. Coming up. The people I pull half frozen from the surface usually avoid coming back. Celeste mentioned one of her scavenging parties found me. Thanks for saving my life. I suppose I'm a glutton for punishment. You know, the green flame and feral animals aren't all you'll need to worry about up here. This is the first time I've had to deal with the possibility of camping in such conditions. A good camping spot may be the difference between life and death. Make sure your overwatch has a high stat so you can sleep, so you can reap the benefits of resting well. It's also an opportunity to get to know your companions. Your lives are in each other's hands, after all. What should I be worried about up here? The spooks are naturally drawn to your presence, so you're being hunted, and the mo the monsters you set foot out the mo the moment you set foot out here, almost everything has an 
irrational desire to see you dead. Make sure the person leading your team can detect traps. You'll have plenty to contend with between the nature natural obstacles, traps set by the green flame, race, and mad survivors. A lot of strange things are afoot here. I'm sure you have plenty of tales from the field. You don't know the half of it. You'll see enough when when you encounter a strange event, consider your options carefully before making their next move. What happens next could save or be the death of your party. Alright. Take this. We call it the Geistometer. It'll t let you know when the spooks are getting close by measuring the ghost fog. It's an interesting com uh, contraption. Check its status at the bottom left of your screen. When the ghost fog comes, you'll know the mad shades are nearby. When that happens, make sure you leave the area as quickly as possible. They sound like a handful to contend with. Just try to come back in one piece, soldier. Terror will increase as your party explores the field. It will drop again when you encounter a new neighborhood. Use the Geist Meter to monitor the ghost fog and stay ahead of the threat pursuing you. Neat. Okay, so, hang on. Do you... Which one of you has the ability to... to darn it, which... I can't remember which one can see traps. Can I, can I get a... Ah, what the heck is this? Lyric will occasionally gain points that can be used to boost a perk of your choice on this page. Choose carefully. Once you make a decision, there's no going back. Okay, I don't, don't need that. I need to know who can see. Hey there, Anime Echo. How you doing? Uh, I guess I should have been taking notes. I don't remember who can see what. Oh, wait. It's the person with the highest stat. Okay, so I hate to do it, but you're going to be up front. Because you can see traps. Huh. Everybody stop. This is the force. This is the frost fence. Be careful around that. The green flame have been putting... Putting them up around the city to block our way. That's the reason I'm here. What's the plan? I thought you knew a way around it. No, we're going through it. You can't be serious. Touching it is instant death. How do you think I got in the city to begin with? Alright, everyone. Step back. I'm only one with this... I've only done this once before, and I honestly don't know what's going to happen next. It goes nothing. Ah, I'm doing all right. It's gone. What kind of magic is that? This fan brace protects me from arconic magic. You could use it to help us escape this city. It seems I can can destroy these smaller frost fences, but that's not the case for the frost bell surrounding it. Uh, ice nair. Okay, let's move out. Don't go on it! Now you messed up the party again! I, I had it all fixed! And now you go, oh, well, we have to have. Ugh, it's all messed up. No, don't dismiss him. I just got him. Hey, you. Nope. <laughs> Okay, so, no wait, she needs to be over here, he needs to be up, she's technically needs to be up here, but he's gonna be up here, because he can see traps, and it's fine, traps are, are, are fine, it's all fine, huh. taking this, let's move out, with that, do I shoot it, do I shoot it, what is that? 
Mortals, it seems the terror. The traffic is busy in the entertainment district today. My name is Garrett. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. Hands up where I can see them. You... you can speak? There is no need for hostilities. I come in peace. A simple merchant of fine wares. How did you pass the frost fence? The frost fence is not in... impertinent to me. I have the ability to walk through it. Interesting indeed. You must possess a magic that is neither blood nor hedge. Hmm, I suspect a sense of urgency in your manner. I'm sh willing to help you in a show of good faith. You said traffic was busy today. Did you see someone pass through here? As a matter of fact, I did. I passed a woman today. Tall, dark, and brooding she was. That sounds like our woman. Which way did she go? Ah, well, generosity does have its limits. I'd be willing to point you in the right direction. For a prize. What do you want? I'm searching for something, nothing important. Just a small golden company seal known as Oak Sea. That's the same seal Maru's looking for. My dear, you would stand to gain much from such a deal with me. I merely seek your agreement to return the Oaksha to me, should you stumble upon it. And why, pay you tell, would a wraith need such a thing? Much like my living counterparts, I am still a merchant dealing with physical goods. No death has not dim dampened my ambitions. However, with the authority of the seal, I could relegate trade amongst the wraith. It's highly unlikely I'm going to stumble at this oaksy, but I'll let you know if I do. You need to learn a thing or two about doing business, girl. In any case, I saw your woman. She was heading north towards the ghost bazaar. Conspicuously, I'm hearing the same well. Beware the road. There, there is no safe. There is not safe for the living. And the bazaar is even more dangerous. I've heard tale of the merchant Mundok. Terrible thing, what happened? The King of Shades corrupted Mudok and turned her into a vengeful shade under his control. But she was once an individual of great renown. Now her co corrupted spirit is maddening the minds of the race in her local area, though I do not know the full extent of their damage. We need to head out now. Maybe sh maybe we'll see that ghost at the bazaar. Go with the All Mother Warm Blood. Radio. Well, I assume we're heading in that direction. <laughs> You can retreat to Dalric at any time from the pause menu. You will keep your surviving allies and loot, but lose your ex expedition progress. Find reliable shelters between neighborhoods to craft and use items. Unfortunately, your team will be exposed and unable to rest here. What's in here? Bacon Street. My aim to is through. No, oh dear, I need to switch. How do that? Okay. Switch to 
Watch you out. Surprised that actually hit. Oh, those aren't good at all. Dang, he got hurt a lot. So I assume that's gives them a debuff of but gives them more strength. I'm gonna kill you out of the way. Next turn you should die. Yay! Spectral dust, a purple colored dust left behind by necromancers. Okay, okay. Billion chip, a precious metal that is used in, as currency in a bygone time can be traded for hellion. Cool. Okay, so now I want to know. Probably gonna do his. Yep. I've got about half health left. Man, this guy's good. I like him. Ah, he died. Probably should have done that with the guy with more health, but eh, it's fine. He can out uh, wraps. Yeah. 
Keep a wary eye. You find the withered corpse of a woman clutching a jeweled box. It looks as if she died trying to protect the precious counter, uh, contents inside. Your curiosity is piqued, but it doesn't seem appropriate to disturb the dead. Mmm, I want it though! Mmm! Like I want it, but karma gonna come back and bite me and I know it! Could be... Kindness is going to be the, my downfall. Oh, we are losing sanity like a rock. It sounds strange, but there is something familiar about Isabel. I feel as if I know her. Hello. If it does... If it does not bring... If it does not breathe, you gotta use silver boots to put it down. Mm -hmm. A nice spot. Our party is safe for now. It's fine, we'll, we'll do that. Wait, can I, I need to access items. How do I do that? Oh, I guess actually down, boy. Okay, do I have anything that actually heals? I have, this one I have. Because she's in the worst state. Is save that. Right, let's continue on. Why is there an arrow going that way? Why are we going the opposite direction? Keep a wary eye. You find a large banquet table lavished with delicious feast. Who could have prepared such a huge meal in a place like this? It could be a trap, but even you are tempted in s to sample the delicious the delicacies. It needs to be checked. I mean, I'd rather no one check it. Like, at all. Because, like, no? I guess have her check it. Inspect the food. Did you eat it? I don't think, I think, I think we avoided the trap. Are we? Exit to progress. Okay.
Okay, so where are we now? Okay, we're here. So we need to head. Oh, we almost had it. We need to head back up in here. I think if I'm correct. Yeah, so we just, we were like well on our way up there. Why is this taking long? Yeah, I know we need to leave. Oh no, that's not good. That's not good at all. Oh lordy, that's not good. All right, swippity swap. That's not good at all. Why are you taking out my guy? Okay, we gotta take these guys out. Take you out in the back. Wouchies. Oh, jeez, that's not good. You know, I think we need to start using our vigors. Or whatever you call these stupid things. I hit the wrong button. good really not good we need to get out of this neighborhood now we've got a serious problem Fraggle, fraggle. This is not good at all. Uh, we're gonna die. Our our gunsman's gonna die, real fast. It's like he's. I mean, it doesn't matter because they've got archers, but 
Yeah, we need to retreat. We haven't made any progress, so we're just gonna, I'm gonna make the executive decision to run. No, not him, not him, no! Retreat, 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 hmm. yes, retreat. No good. Retreat. We we were not not ready for that. Like we I guess I messed around too much trying to get through trying to, to traverse and that caused a big problem. So We'll have to get a new new companion and hope they're as good. Okay. All right. Great all around protects allies. I really like you. You're a good all arounder. Let's see who's got. I mean, who? Well, let's. Yeah, let's recruit him. Okay, we definitely need to rest, so. Because we are. Not only did we use up some of our material getting back but we are severely hurt I don't know if this helps I don't know if that helps at all that does not seem to help anything did that help anything okay cool that that heals the entire party you catch it okay that's good to know Go ahead. And first with him. Okay. <laughs> huh? hey. So now we need to head to this place. Grab some more stuff. Do I even have any money? I got one dollar! One dollar dollar bill, dollar bill, dollar dollar bill. Wait, can I... Okay, cool, so I keep my stuff. I don't know if this is any of any of it's useful. Okay. So Oh here we go, fur vest. Well dang, son! I need that, but
I need that, but at the same time, I ain't got no money. Because I also need your healing items way more. Okay, all this is usable while camping, so I please Okay. Okay. You're really good. Hope for this time we don't all just. <laughs> I guess head to here because I don't know what this green glow is, but whatever. That's not a good. Sign. I need to readjust the party. He avoided that, but I want him at the front, so that way we really avoid... Gosh darn it! What you want? Hey, y'all. Don't run up with an axe to me. Coach, don't run up with an axe to me. That's rude. Very rude. It's very rude of you. Very rude indeed. Gonna have to smack you. What you get? Why y'all gotta be so violent? My squishy organs. There you go. Hey, buddy. Thump. I'd love a beastie area. I wonder what these guys... Like, are these guys just madmen? Seasonings and that stuff. Okay, swap back. This is getting really tedious, but eh. If I can avoid traps, then I am good. Okay, we have to keep an eye on our um stuff. We can't then. Keep a wary eye. Is that a dog? You find a ghostly dog blocking your path. It watches you with calm but curious eyes. Nothing about its demeanor seems threatening. Then again, you can presume to know the mind of a supernatural beast. Ah, this is gonna hurt. Don't hurt me, please. Is 
dog as it continues to sit calmly. You slowly kneel, holding out your hand. When the ghost dog sees your gesture, it suddenly lashes out, mauling you with its sharp teeth before running off into the dark. Screw you, animal! It's a, you're a, it's a foxin! Why you gotta be that way, man? You're basically cousins, except not quite. You're <laughs> DM, I demand a re-roll. My dice are loaded. I really like this game. Like, it, it's it's like a D&D campaign. I mean, that's what Darkest Dungeon is, too. But it's just that, like, like both games are kind of there just to screw you over every chance they can. And I absolutely love it. Just because it's like, great, awesome. I'm having the time of my life. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering if keeping you up front is a bad idea. I'm going to just do it. So I can get the good hit in. Oh, but wait, you can't do anything. Well, fudge. I kind of forgot she's basically an upfront. Is that a lady with... Oh, no, I thought she had, like, panties on her head. I was very confused there for a second. Ow, my guts. My squishy bits. How dare ya. You hit me squishy bits. There, that way we get in turn. Please hit. Nice. Still forgot you can't do anything. Probably should swap. It's whaling time! We gotta be efficient. Because A, I don't want that poltergeist junk getting in our way again. Who's got the most? Okay, so you. So I actually need. I actually need. Swap to you. Open. Bag of seeds. Cool. And swap back. Honestly, wish they made that a lot. Gosh darn it. I kind of wish they'd make this section a little bit. or this type of thing easier to do. Okay, I'm assuming this whole entire... I hate all of ya! I hate all of ya! Now I'm... Now I'm, I'm scared. You know what? It's it's not worth the... I mean... It, it, on it. Stop it. It'd be nice to have the extra loot, but... With as much treasure chests as this place has, I'm I'm concerned. And there was nothing to be concerned about, and so it was just a waste of my dang time. Oh, hmm.
Oh, awesome. Um, do you have anything I... Oh, mama. Okay. I'm gonna sell. Wait, who... Uh, wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Who has the highest merchant... Um, mercantile? Oh, you do, honey! Um, here. You talk to him, baby boo. Hundred. I don't know if I need it, but I'm gonna sell it. Swap back, and we'll buy one of these, and then also, can I buy anything that's used for healing? Doesn't look like it. Okay, well, that's fine. Um, swap that to you. And then bag. But what does it do? Vigor plus two max health. Who has the least amount of health? Let's do this economically. 17, 24, 17. Dang, so it's a coin flip. Um okay. Well obviously she's tails, because she's got a tail. So flip a coin. It's heads. Cool. That means I get it. Am I heading the right direction or am I just heading in a dank circle? Probably should check the map. Oh, we de oh, we definitely need to rest. It's going to hurt us a bit, but we certainly need rest. We can't afford to This is going to suck. We've got two two more places and then we can leave. Um It's going to suck. Do I have any items that can help their replenish their vigor without Minus one health, but plus one vigor. I'm gonna risk it. It's probably not a good idea, but I'm gonna risk it. Alright. Hello. Mm 
Alright, let's continue moving on. Okay, we're almost out. Good. Mm. We can't afford much of these. Oh, uh, I can't afford much of these. Should we run or not? Can I afford more hits? Pull out the big guns. That's what I'm talking about. We just have their damage. Now it's down to one. He used a lot of vigor, or not a, a vigor, but uh, points, but it's fine. what they're here for. Right. Let's hurry the heck out. Almost out. We go made it up safe and sound more or less this is the workshop you can craft valuable items here some of which cannot be purchased from merchants you will need resources to craft new items which you can but you have what you need in your inventory the option to craft will be available I think said I would have the availability option. I ain't got none of this stuff. They can't make anything. Can we rest? What's the point of having this fire here? I guess to use healing items, which I desperately need. Like everyone else seems relatively fine, except for her, her. Um, Vigor is not doing too hot. I'll sacrifice a couple of her hit points. Heal her up. 
so wait. Hang on, am I... Wow, this is a very bad tutorial. <laughs> like, just FAQ screen. 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 Okay, um... No, no. No, 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 no. Okay. Fill the 10 streets. Check the map. Fill the each neighborhood. Exit the crowd. Each street has at least one encounter event. Street encounter icon will be displayed. We need to clear five neighborhoods to reach the boss dungeon. The map is available in the next. What about running? Because I know. Ah, here we go. You can treat it at any time from pause menu. You will keep your son. Okay, so I could leave, but it would cause me to lose progress. Risk it. Now he avoids it. Yeah, cause he's great. Screw you, mimic. You dink. No, cause he avoids it. Cause he's great. You dink. Okay. Um. Let me check our map here. Good gravy. This is a mess. I guess we go up. I'm really worried about my... Hey, Neverman, how you doing? We should be fine. Should be fine. Did you just roll up in here like Sonic the Hedgehog? I'm gonna take you up. Heck was that? Right, I forgot you can't do anything. Okay. Flopping. That's not good. That's not good. Hyper concern now in progress. Oh, she's not doing hot.
Do I have any healing ability? I don't think so. I think we should run. I think we should definitely run because I don't think she's going to make it. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, um, if we make her run, uh, but she's not going to make it in time. Okay, that's fine. Okay, you, I need to run. I need you to run away. You just sock me in the face. Okay, and you, I want swapped out. Take that. Okay, we're doing okay without her. But I don't know what we're gonna do. Oof. Mm. I don't know what we're gonna do next fight. Cause we've got a problem. And we don't have I don't think we have enough healing items. We've got one bomb. Can we head backward, though, without incurring... We're so close, though. Back in that bit. Okay. Idea. Uh, it's a stupid idea, but it's an idea. What we'll do is we will have... I follow. And I know this is a bad idea because it in could incur a trap. But I'm going to risk it. Nope, wrong party member. Oh my gosh, do you have a... <laughs> I, I need something I can heal myself with now. Not later, but now. I need like a big old batch of, yes, this. Now I need a bed to sleep in or something somewhere safe. But it doesn't look like I'm gonna get that. Yay! <laughs> mm. 
Check them out. I need to head out. I'm gonna die. Unless we are very lucky. Okay. We made it. Oh, thank heaven. Okay. Oh, that was too close. Way. Way too close. You use that. Right the heck now. I hate to let her use all our healing items, but, like, she is hurting the most. Okay. Let's see if we can craft anything. Man, can I, like, make anything at all? Like, anything at all? No. I really think we should just not. We should just go. Oh boy. Oh, grand. If I can take you out first. Oh. Well, you'll just cast Hex. Which will give you guys more strength, but hurt you every turn, which is kind of dumb. Because we're going to be hurting you more. Wait, you mean she can be in third row and still hit him? She's got that range? I did not know this! Yeah, I feel like we need to switch. But if I hit him first, that means I get another turn. That means you're dead. And then... You I know I can't kill in one turn. Ooh, that's trouble for him. Definitely should move him. I mean, now it doesn't really matter, but... Oh gosh, 
Why? Oh, great. Roller coley, dude. Alright, yeah, we're gonna want to move him. Because I don't have good faith that he's going to live. Like if we can kill you for, for in the second turn, then that's fine. Because then we can just have take pot shots at this guy. Because I don't think that guy, the, the other guy, attacks at all. I don't know. Doesn't seem like it. Seems like he's more support. So if I can get rid of him, we can have a pretty okay fight. But the problem is he's also tank. At least I've never seen him attack. I've never seen this guy, that guy attack. So I don't think, I don't think we got any problems. But he's almost dead. All right, now he's dead. Yeah, he does not attack. Pretty sure, yeah, his thing blocks all physical attacks, it looks like, but not ranged. Yeah, our gunsman is really hurting for certain. I don't... I don't know what to do, because, like... If I leave, I lose all this progress, but I know we heckin' can't fight a boss, not in this state. Ah, and that's why we keep him around. Wait, did we come through this way? Yeah, so. Back down. Oof, yeah, we might want to move. We might want to get that guy. Oi there. <laughs> we need some morale boost. I know it's gonna raise the terror, but I can't afford to have my team go insane. Or whatever the heck will happen if we don't. But I don't have anything that will help them. We took the long way around. Can I go back and not... You know... There's no other path. This is down! Quickest route. Oh. Hey, our merchant friend. I mean, the guy hates to sell anything. Mainly because we definitely need, like, Health stuff. Or we definitely need, like... Oh, come on! You can't sell it to me for... <sighs> you are an awful, awful... Man.
Great. Oh, great. I've got two whole... Like, sections. Of just... Oh, joy. Well, he definitely needs to move. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna live through this if we're not careful. Yeah, we're not. We, we need to leave. We need to leave now. I need everyone to run. Now. We're, we're leaving. It's gonna suck, because all this progress... We lost him. There's nothing we can do. Always the gunner! It is always the gunner! Oh, yeah. No good. We were so close. We were so close. Darn it. I think we're not I don't even know if we're making progress. Like, I don't even know, man. I don't even know if I'm making any progress here. I'm just, like, trying my hardest not to die, and I'm flailing like a fish, man. I think the worst part is, is I lose all progress, so it's like... And since the party doesn't keep traditional levels... Like, I'm like, oh man, what did I do? Oh, you're cute. I mean... I, I guess I'll go with you. We need a fourth companion. Let's go, Mater! And also heal. But I think, honestly, the, 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 that was my last run, because I'm like... Oh, you're cute. Okay, let's take a look at you. Finding vines... Detective Light. So you're our healer. Okay. Okay. Now everyone's rested and ready to roll again. Alright. So I think, honestly, I'm gonna leave it here. And I know it doesn't seem like we did much, and I don't know if we actually did anything. But it's almost, like, midnight, and, like, I'd like to get some sleep. But I honestly can't tell if we made any progress. I, I don't know. I feel like it's it, this is definitely, like, one of those games where it takes a long time to progress. You have to be in it for the long haul. And I know probably, like, three hours a stream is not very like long in terms of progression in this game but like also i don't know i feel like i learned a lot and i'm gonna keep trying but good gravy this hurts my soul may it, you might say it leaves my soul very cold eh? Eh? You get it yeah you get it anyway um you might see more of this game in the future because I I like its aesthetic. I love how it plays. It, it is very. It scratches that D and D game itch, while also being horribly, horribly just. Oh gosh, I'm like gonna cry. <laughs> kind of way, which like I don't know. I like, honestly. Of this stuff in the 
I think you do. But, um... I will probably play more of it in the future. Don't know when, because um, the next stream we're actually doing Demo. Uh, the it's it's the newest version of Demo, and then I think Demo Two just got announced. So, you know, it's almost like I plan these things or something. I've, I've got like my third eye open, and I'm just like knowing everything in the future. But anyway, guys. Um, Again, you'll see this in the future, probably, some point. I don't know when. Maybe for Valentine's Day. Probably sooner than that, though. But, like, I think maybe I'll do this for a Valentine's Day stream just to, like, make myself hurt. <laughs> but, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a fantastic day. If you want to check out Van Brace Cold Soul, there's a link in the description down below. It is available for pretty much everything as far as I'm aware. I know it's on Switch. I know it's on... Which are actually watching me play it on Switch right now. Um, but I know it's also available on PC, I believe, and Xbox One, PS4. But I'm not entirely sure on those last two. Uh, but I do know it is available for Switch and the PC. You mean I could have made stuff in here this entire time? Is that is that what you're telling me? I'm not reading your text. Yep, that's exactly what you're telling me. I, I, okay, well, learn something new. Anyways, I will catch you guys all the time with more crazy content in the future. Thank you to my wonderful patrons for making stuff like this possible, especially um, purpley the purpliest, Hannah Wolf, and Mick Scales. They are my five dollar tier, and they get their names read out. In the most glorious of fashion, I'm yours truly. And if you would like to support me and uh, donate to my Patreon, it is not required, but it helps out the channel a lot, then uh, you can find it also in the link description down below. What the heck is this place? Hmm. I don't know how to feel about this. Step back, Outlander. The Narzari have heard whispers of your arrival here. Just because you've released some doesn't mean you can freely wander here. Please use an argument. You're a hunter now? I must admit, I'm surprised they granted you this death so quickly. I wonder why. This place may f makes me feel like I'm back in Zemdurd. Is this a good place or a bad place? What is this? A human approaching. This one looks different from the others, though. What brings you to a corner of Delrich outline there? I may be indie, but I count many friends amongst the Nazari. I believe a few have been saying how does it go again? Ah, yes. Actions speak louder than words. Perhaps you will find out how worthy you are soon enough. What is this place? Is this a place I can do stuff? Uh... don't know what this place is. Interesting. Don't know. Huh. I found a page for my thing. Ooh, hello, nurse. Oh yeah, we could probably chat with that one chick at the tavern now that we've gone on a couple expeditions. Failed horribly, but also we went on expeditions. So she she didn't say we had to succeed, just had to say, hey, we we, we went on those 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 things. I'm actually gonna do that real quick. are interesting little dark elf people it, it seems seems they're dark elves don't know for sure and i'm assuming the people like this chick right here i'm assuming they're characters we can recruit at some point 
but like they're really strong so they won't deal with us until later on in the game i guess that or they're just characters that will eventually be in the story and they're not characters you can actually have in your party i don't know over here we went over here uh i want to oh you know what? we'll go over here don't know what's over here yeah i've got this paper look at my paper I hold it aloft no you get a paper huh. go up here This way. This way. It's creepy. This place is like a maze. I'm. I am now officially lost. Thanks, game. Huh. Guess I'll head back this way. This way? I, I don't know where this is going. Kind of, just kind of rolling. Again, don't know if I'm, if I'm heading in circles or not. I don't feel like I am, but there's a, a high possibility I might be. Just head back into the... Ah, okay. Cool, made it out. Let's go talk to that tavern chick, see if maybe she wants to join or at least acknowledge my existence. Something. I mean, I guess she kind of did acknowledge my existence. But the point is, is I want to know if she'll actually talk to me, and then we'll end the stream there. Hello. Nope. Nope. Well, fine then. But anyway, guys, I'll catch you on the flip side of more crazy content in the future. And, uh, yeah, check out, uh, or stay tuned for, um, the 31st, where, or no, wait, this, the, today's the, technically the 31st, but, um, I guess tomorrow then, wouldn't it be? Technically. Um, anyway, on the 1st of January, to celebrate the ringing in of 2020, we will be playing Demo Reborn, I believe is the name, um, on the PS4. So, you guys can look forward to that copyright mess of content. Yay. But, anyway guys, I will catch you on the flip side of more crazy content in the future. Bye bye But before we go, just wanted to give a big old thank you to my $5 patrons, Mix Scales and Purply, the purpliest. If you would like to support me, there's a link in the description down below to my Patreon. From there, you can join-